Hello, um, this is a quick video on my Raspberry Pi quiz that I made. Um, so the bit of the codes on the screen at the moment, I'll just, there's my Python shell. Um, so I'll just run the code and then I'll go through the, um, the program. Okay, so the first question, what's the name of the items on the Pi that can be attached to inputs and outputs? outputs which are often used in robotics it's got all the uh, answers quite a few of them made up and um, so I think it's A so I'll put that in press enter and it'll say that's correct so next question it'll say apart from a Wi-Fi dongle how else could you connect to the, your Pi to the internet so it's obviously C Ethernet cable um, I think all the others there are made up so I put a C and it says that's right. The next question, so what is everything stored on, on a Pi? It's obviously an SD card. Um, so I'll just put SD card in for D. So then that's right. Then it just carries on through the question. So fourth question, what are the ports that are used to connect a mouse, keyboard, etc. And it's obviously a USB cable. So... I'll just go through the answers, so there's input determinators, all made up, so yeah, so I'll put B in and it says that's right, so fifth question, I'll just go up to five questions in this, um, it's C, Samsung, not many people know that, so C, that's right. Right, so now I'll explain the code, so firstly, input time, um, the time is used in the time.sleep that we'll use later and then set score to zero because if you just put like add one to the score every time it won't do anything because it doesn't know where to start then it prints hi guys and welcome to the raspberry pi quiz so then it has question one here and uh, so it prints question one then prints what um, the answers could be and then it assigns answer to raw input well, assign raw input to answer, and then if the answer is A, which is GPI opens, it adds one to the score with score equals score plus one. Then print, well done, that's correct. And then if you don't get A, print, uh, that's wrong. So then, and then wait two seconds. There, that's with the time that we imported before. And then question two, and basically it just repeats itself all the time. Uh, keeps repeating itself so if it's right that's right print that's wrong until we get to the bottom here and then it prints well done you completed the quiz and scored and then it waits two seconds prints the score and it says out of 10 and then if score is 10 print you passed else you failed so that's just a quick overview of the code um, thanks for watching guys.